Hey everybody, for today's lab, you will need a measuring cup with one cup of water in it, a plastic spoon, cornstarch, two clear cups, and iodine, which you can find at any grocery store. So your first step is that you'll take about half of a teaspoon of cornstarch and mix it into your cup of water. And estimating in this lab is okay, but try to keep it to about half a teaspoon. And stir that up completely until the starch is completely dissolved. Then you'll pour a little less than a quarter of a cup, depending on what size your cups are, into both of your clear cups. And then you are going to literally spit into the second cup which I didn't take a video of because I wasn't sure that you really wanted to see me spitting into a cup. But that's what you're going to do. And then the next step will be to mix in that saliva with your spoon. Then wait 30 minutes. After your 30 minutes, you'll drip five drops of iodine into each of the cups. And then you're gonna stir both cups. Start with the one on the left that doesn't have the saliva in it so that you don't contaminate that one. Give them both a good stir. And when you're finished with that, you're going to wait one hour and then check them again. And after an hour, here's what we have. So on the left, we have the starch and iodine, and on the right, we have the one with the saliva in it. And you can see that the iodine reacts as it normally does with the starch on the left-hand side. On the right hand side, that is clearer and it's showing the yellowish um, iodine because it is not reacting with the starch and that's because the saliva has begun to break down some of those large starch molecules into smaller glucose molecules. And so that iodine is no longer able to react with some of that starch and that's what gives it the yellowish color instead of that blue black of the iodine and starch mixture. So you can see there how the enzyme salivary amylase works to break down starch in your spit or in your saliva.